You know that feeling when you're about to start your day and you already know it's gonna be a long one? That's this morning. The commute used to bother me, but I've learned to use this time differently now. This is my calm before the storm. No distractions, no team messages, just me and some tech podcasts. There it is, another day in the office. Some people hate the commute into the city, but honestly, I kind of love it. Every single morning starts the same way. I check for alarms and check for high priority tickets. Now, I already know nothing's on fire because I would have seen messages on my phone when I woke up, but lots can happen overnight. And <laughs> there it is, remote site switch down. It's really common to see remote sites go down for various reasons, hardware failure, power outage, someone tripping over a cable. I can see it rebooted, power failure. And yep, it's back up. I don't really need to investigate further. Someone probably bumped a power cable or had to kill power to swap something out. Time to hit the road again. Got a site visit to handle. They're having wireless issues and want to add more access points. But first, every time I'm in this building, I make sure the elevator music is working because I set up the network for it and every single time it goes down, I get the call. We're here and the only tool I need today, my NetAlly Cyberscope. I'm not doing a full site survey, just checking signal levels in a few key spots. Here's the issue. They've got zero outdoor coverage and they wanna add it, which makes sense, but outdoor deployments are a different beast altogether. And here's why. This is where we run the cables. And look at this, rodent damage. We're gonna have to run conduit and seal everything up to protect the cabling. Or we'll just be back here in six months doing the same thing all over again. And this AP, it's not booting up because of the cable damage. I had to take a video of this, a microwave sitting right next to an access point. I really hope they're not complaining about slow Wi-Fi during lunch. We need to make sure there's enough resources to support the new APs. Plenty of PoE ports available, but the power budget, that might be tight. I'll probably need to add some extra power supplies to bump up the available wattage. I'm back on the road, but instead of heading back to the main office, I'm close to our data center, so I'm just gonna go swing by there and finish out the day. This is one of my favorite places to work. Less distractions and random people stopping by my desk. Back to the grind, checking tickets, emails, alerts that I might've missed while I was on site. I've got a few firewall tickets to update, some paperwork to knock out, and then I can finally get back to the project I've been excited about. This is what I've been working on, redesigning our guest wireless infrastructure to add redundancy and bring it in line with best practice. It's been a really fun project, honestly. It's the kind of work that makes you feel like you're actually building something, not just putting out fires. And lastly, meetings. We're talking about firewall policy change procedures, trying to streamline how we submit requests to the security team and all that fun stuff. Not the most exciting part of the day, but it's really necessary. And that's it. Time to pack up and head home. Thanks for keeping me company today. And don't forget to follow me, you nerds.